Party. Auntie Manya, really big question today. Yes. How would I go about organising a cultural burn as a non-Indigenous person? Yeah, well, cultural burning, for those who don't know, is just Indigenous practices around caring for country through burning methods. And it varies right across the country, the different techniques and, and so on. But how you'd go about doing it is you'd want to set out certain parameters and that. Well, firstly, as an ally, I just want to find out as much as I can about cultural burning. And, and there's been a massively renewed interest in yes. this uh, practice given, you know, the, the damage of the fires and non-Indigenous people way of approaching fire. Uh, and as Auntie Manya, Manya said, <laughs> cultural burning traditional way is much more about looking after plants, looking after country and slow, cool burns um, at the right times. So I would find a lot more about it. And there's a couple of organisations or many organisations I'd approach. I'd find out if there are any organisations in my local area. But I, I know of two organisations, mm -hmm. um, Fire Sticks Alliance, Indigenous yes. Corporation, and the um, Koori Country Fire Sticks Aboriginal Corporation. And both of those have a lot of resources and workshops on how to go about it. So fantastic question. And we wish you all the best uh, with your cultural burn. Ask, Ask Auntie. Auntie.